up there, we'll, we'll wait there for you. Good up. Right. Right. The Bay, Napier City, Havlo uh, Hastings City, Havelock North Village, which is just down on the other side of Timata Peak there. Um, on a clear day, you'd see through to Mount Ruapehu, way up, uh, or way down south, looking uh, way down there. And then if you turned around and you happened to look at about the same direction as the buses uh, facing, uh, you'd see the Pacific Ocean. Yeah, Carnookas and Carnookas and trees were growing very well. So you got some people in, they had a look around and they said you've got a major possum problem. So you've got to come be in. Back in those days, the meat as well as the skins were worth money, so they were have been uh, I've seen up one commercial one for people from other countries and I'm getting Jew to do another one any time. There's more little ducks down on the dam down there below us. And this uh, rodent feeds here. You have a look, very fine netting on the side. Stop the stokes, ferrets, weasels and rats getting in there. Have a look down there. Now we're going down to the bottom of that. Now the naming of Cape Kidnappers. Uh, was named by that famous Englishman, Cook, sailing around New Zealand in 1769. He anchored his sailing ship, the Endeavour, in the bay just below the Cape out here and I'll point the bay out to you when we get up. While he was doing all that, of course, the Maoris were taking a long, hard look at him and because of his dark skin, they thought that he was one of their own. So at the end of the trading session, they grabbed the boy, the young fellow, put him in that canoe and uh, started paddling back to shore.
Oh, yeah. 